Good afternoon, uh, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Henri Koebufumbo, and I am the president of the Congolese Community of Men. And we are here to march for the killings that are happening in Congo. We are here to break the silence. Our brothers and sisters are dying there. And this is why we are here. I'm going to pass the mic to all of our members so they can tell you how much we are crying why the international opinion is staying in silence. We are tired, enough is enough. People are being killed as chickens, as goats, and it must stop. This is why we are here today. This is why we are marching. You're going to hear from our fellow members why these things are happening and there is a silence. Thank you. So I do have here the Henri, which is uh, public relations, is going to say a word about the march of today. Henry, what are you thinking about it, my friend? Uh, thank you for asking me that question. I think we're all here. It's because of what is happening in our country. As you can see on those pictures right there, people are dying, our families are being killed, and then the rest of the world are not even saying a word about it. We've seen what is happening in other countries, and they always focus on so where are all those international channel TV CNN Fox all those news stations they're not even talking about it this is the serious issue they're gonna wait until the whole country is gone and then they're gonna regret about it this is the time to stop this killing that's all I have it's so sad that the rest of the world are not even thinking about Africa it looks like the whole they only care about some mineral what is getting from our country Congo we want them to do something about our country we want them to do whatever they can do to stop to prevent something like this to continue that's all I have to say thank you thank you uh, we do have pastor Bean who is among us he decided not to stay at home but he is here with us and uh, Pastor Bean, uh, I know you do have something to say about the, that day that we are gathering today. Uh, we are here because we are wounded. Our fellow citizens are being destroyed, killed like animals. Life is a gift from God. Yeah. Nobody has a right to take a life from somebody. Yeah. We are talking to you, brothers. Yeah. You, we can stand as a citizen of this world to plead for this case. How young Piki Piki are killed. How ladies are raped. Houses are being burned, schools destroyed. Hospitals and uh, uh, medical personnel are being destroyed, killed and burned. Who's going to speak for us? I ask you, my brothers and sisters, to join us and stand and let this, what is going on in our country, to stop. God bless you. As we, we ask this, please help us to stop what is going on right now. Absolutely, it must stop. It must stop. And uh, my brother, I know that you are angry for what's happening there. I know. I'm going to let you speak. Hi, so my name is Danny and I'm from Congo and uh, I, I decided today, today uh, together with my brothers and sisters to stand up and raise a voice about what's going on in our country because what's happening there is just like a genocide and I know that the United States is against such thing happening in the world and this is the opportunity we're giving to you people so that you can join us and say a word about what's going on we want this massacre to stop eastern part of the Congo is the part of the world so you cannot just stay silent in front of what's happening we cannot let these people continue to kill and 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 do whatever they want with our fellow citizen that's why we decided today to join our, our forces and and raise a voice to say that this massacre should stop thank you thank you thank you uh this is you can see what's happening there and this is not good at all so I'm going to ask a question in French and then I'm going to translate in English. Bandeko, situation yozo simbate, ça doit cesser. Tout est le miawa, eh? 
qu'est-ce qui se passe Why Why people must die like that Why there is a silence Are we chickens Are we goats That people are coming to destroy us like that Pourquoi est-ce que nous devons mourir comme ça Je vais passer la parole à quelqu'un ici. Hein? Quelqu'un va dire à un moment, mon frère, dis quelque chose. Bon, mon nom c'est Barthélemy Louboula. Je viens du Congo, je suis originaire du Congo. So, his name is Barthélemy Boula. He is from Congo, originally from Congo. Ouais, je voulais parler à, pro à propos de le pays Congo, c'est notre pays, à propos de ce qui se passe au Congo. En tout cas, nous sommes très touchés avec ce qu'on a vu, comme on, on tue les enfants, les, les, les gens, comme les animaux. En tout cas, on voulait demander à l'ONU les droits de l'homme. On voit si, comme si les droits de l'homme, ça n'existe pas au monde. Les, les pays sont tentés de pleurer des années et des années. Maintenant, il y a autant de millions qui, qui sont tentés de, de mourir chaque jour, chaque jour. Mais on ne voit pas l'ONU, on ne voit pas les droits de l'homme. Où est les droits de l'homme Nous sommes aux États-Unis, là où il y a les droits de l'homme. On voudrait que les problèmes ici, que les droits de l'homme, l'ONU, qui puissent nous regarder ces problèmes. S'ils ne regardent pas, en tout cas, on ne on, on on sait pas comment on peut faire avec la situation. On demande... Avec, on pleure chaque jour, ce n'est pas parce que nous sommes aux états unis que nous sommes calmes et nous sommes en paix. Comme on voit nos frères, ils sont, euh, ils sont massacrés, ils sont assassinés dans notre, dans notre pays. En tout cas, on ne peut pas être à l'aise dans ces pays, les états unis Malgré nous sommes aux états unis mais nous ne sommes pas en paix. On voulait que l'ONU puisse regarder la situation ici qui se passe dans notre pays. On pleure chaque jour, chaque nuit. En tout cas, c'est le million de millions qui est en train de mourir au Congo. En tout cas, que l'ONU puisse regarder la situation ici. Je vous remercie que tout le monde puisse prendre la, la, la responsabilité de ces situations au monde, au niveau du monde. Mm. I'm going to summarize here. The brothers are complaining. They say people, we are crying there in Congo. Children have been killed. United Nations. The king, where are you? We need you there. Do something. Uh, we are tired of those killings. And even though we know that the brother is saying that we have the human rights here in America. Please do something, go investigate, go investigate and uh, do something. We cannot continue like that. We are here in America, but our brothers and sisters, our families, they are there, they are dying just like that. And uh, we are feeling the pain, we are mourning. We need something to happen. I'm going to ask another fellow who has something to say. Uh, one second, the ladies. Yeah, bonsoir. Euh, je m'appelle Patricia Katunda, je suis euh, la chargée de femmes, famille et enfants. So this is uh, maman Patricia Katunda, she's in charge of the ladies and families in, in the community. Ok, euh, je m'adresse spécialement aux Nations Unies. Je ne sais pas, en tout cas, je ne sais pas si vraiment les droits de l'homme existent pour les Congolais. Si les Nations Unies voient ce qui se passe dans notre pays... Il y a beaucoup de gens qui meurent chaque jour, des enfants qui ne savent rien, qui ne connaissent absolument rien. Ils sont victimes, on les massacre, on viole nos, le, le maman, on torture, on tue tous les jours ici. Est-ce que la Nation Unie n'est pas au courant de ce qui se passe dans notre pays hein? Que justice soit faite Rendez-nous notre beau et pays, je ne sais pas quoi, qu ce que je peux dire, mais faites quand même quelque chose Hmm? C'est le futur de notre pays qui est en danger. On veut exterminer toute la population. S'il vous plaît, s'il vous plaît, aidez-nous. On pleure chaque jour. On n'est pas tranquille parce qu'il y a la famille qui est restée là-bas. Tu peux te réveiller un bon matin, on te dit on a massacré toute ta famille, ton père, ta mère, tes frères et sœurs. Tu restes seul. S'il vous plaît, Nations Unies. Enough is enough. Stop. Stop. Please help us. Yes, enough is enough as you can hear. Our mothers, our sisters are being raped. What's happening there? United Nations, please go there and uh, bring some peace there. Bring peace in our beautiful country. We need you to do something. I know the brother will say a word. I'm going to just say the little one has something as well to do. Il va dire en... Obama, aide-nous, on a un problème à notre pays. Aide-nous. 
is asking the President Obama to help us. We do have a situation troubles in our country. He said, please, Obama, help us. Can you please repeat again? Encore une fois. Uh, Obama, help nous on a un problem in our country. Help nous save our country. Obama, help us. We do have a problem in our country. Help us save our country, please. Another one. Donc, nous, nous, moi, je m'appelle David Musungela. Euh, on est, on est, And this is David Musengela. Je suis congolais de naissance. On est vraiment fatigué euh, de la communauté, de l'agissement de la communauté nationale et de la communauté internationale plutôt par rapport à ce qui se passe dans notre pays au Congo. Donc, vous devez éventuellement regarder, non seulement euh, suivre les intérêts, mais suivre aussi euh, l'humanisme, c'est-à-dire avoir l'essence de l'humanité pour les Congolais, non seulement les Congolais, tous les Africains qui sont en train de mourir par-ci par-là. Voilà, nous sommes là, ici, nous sommes réunis pour contester de tout ce qui est en train de se faire là-bas. Donc on est mécontent, c'est vraiment inhumain. Inhumain, nous vous supplions que vous puissiez avoir les sens de l'homme, parce que nous croyons qu'il y a un droit de l'homme, l'ONI existe, et que l'ONI puisse regarder éventuellement ce qui se passe au Congo. Donc nous, en tant que Congolais, tous les contrées de la République démocratique du Congo, il y a des tueries, il y a des gens par-ci, par-là, on est allé les tuer. Alors, vous devez faire des investigations pour savoir et pour stopper, pour arrêter ce qui se passe là-bas. Voilà la raison pour notre, notre déclaration. Donc, nous insistons à ce que vous puissiez regarder cela. Oui, yes, pour summarize, human rights, human rights, we need to do, you need to do something about it, because people are dying there. We are tired to see, to hear that we are dying there. Mm -hmm. So, uh, another wide uh, board of directors, the coordinator will say something too. Vous avez vu les images, c'est de la tragédie, c'est du génocide. On tue chez nous, mais votre silence est coupable. Votre silence est suspect. You saw the pictures, you hear the, the news, they're killing people. But your silence is guilty. And are you are, are the silence is guilty? That means you are guilty, you're saying nothing. Your silence is guilty. Yes, um, I'm a Congolese man, right? Um, I just want to call you, your attention to what you are seeing here. What you are seeing here, it's not something that we, we want. No, we could have time to do other things that we could do, but we came here to manifest, to show our disagreement with, with what is going on in our country. Democratic Republic of Congo is the biggest country in Africa. It's in the center of Africa. When there is peace in DRC, there will be peace quite everywhere in Africa. So we are calling your attention to tell you that we need peace in our country. If you are friends of peace, just help us to get peace in our country. We are tired. We are fed up. We don't have time to run again, to talk again about what is going on in our country. We are ready, we are doing, we are showing up all these actions to tell you that we are fed up. And who, help, who, who wants to help us can come along with us. And the one that can step aside will understand that he is guilty and is taking part of what is going on in our country. We call your attention. So we'd like you to come with us so that all of us, we can get the price of peace that Congolese people want. Thank you. Absolutely. Stephanie, you want? My name is Stephanie Triskel. I'm here as a representative of the Board of Directors of the Maine Association for New Americans, MANA, and also as a citizen of the world, um, standing in solidarity with the people of the Congo and the victims of Beni. It is a shame to have um, the international community be so quiet when protests are raised for other countries, European countries, let's also raise them for the deaths of African citizens and Af uh, uh, from, for like those, the citizens of the uh, RDC, uh, DRC. Uh, and uh, this is an atrocity. When we stand up against atrocities, we have to stand up against all atrocities equally. And this is an atrocity where the international community has been silent. We need to raise our voices in protest. When one community is massacred, when one community is attacked, we are all attacked. Human rights are at risk. 
We need to stand together in solidarity with the victims and the families of Beni. Thank you. We are going to finish this side. Thank you. Yeah, ce que nous voulons plus dire ici, toutes ces photos que nous avons amenées ici, mais ils les connaissent. Et l'ennemi qui est en train de, de martyriser, de tuer, il est connu. Le, le Congo est connu. Pourquoi ce silence mm. Et je pense qu'il n'y a rien de nouveau. Les satellites sont branchés là, ils savent. Si nous sommes là, c'est pour la paix. Il y en a qui ont tout abandonné pour venir ici. Et il y en a, nous sommes devenus des citoyens. C'est pour la paix. Ce n'est pas pour la voiture, ce n'est pas pour les maisons, ce n'est pas pour le manger. Et, 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 et finalement, on, que ça s'arrête. Et pourquoi on doit utiliser un individu ou certains individus pour, que, pour tuer les compatriotes et pour, Non, je crois que trop c'est trop. Et vous n'avez qu'à voir seulement le, les images. Et les images parlent. Et, et, et je crois que trop c'est trop. You will see that people are hungry. And they're saying that you saw people are watching the news, the pictures here. People know about it, but why they keep it quiet? United Nations and others. We, we come here. So many are leaving the country and, and coming here. They even becoming citizens. It's not for getting cars or houses or jobs. It's because of the troubles that are happening there. Some are being used to kill others. It must stop. We thank you. We are going to start our march right now. And please, if you know you need our minerals, don't kill people. Do not kill. We thank you. And we are going to meet again. And we also know about other things. But we thank you. We are kicking off our march right now. Thank you very much. Now we have to stop killing Congolese. We are not animals. Kabila! Assassin! Kabila! Assassin! Assassin!